Hey everybody, I'm Robert the Zombie Bargain Hunter, and today it is what's sold on eBay for the week of October 16th through October 22nd. So hopefully everybody's having some great sales. Uh, start of the fourth quarter's here. Um, sales this week weren't um, weren't great. <laughs> uh, they were okay, not uh, what I expected. Um, but uh, yesterday, Monday, uh, I'm doing this video on Tuesday, uh, really picked up, so it was crazy. Um, Saturday and Sunday weren't that good, but Monday really picked up, so hopefully uh, next week will be a, a great week. Um, you can see behind me, I am starting to open uh, some of the Mickey boxes, so anybody that's following me uh, for the card uh, unboxing, I'm going to be doing a case of those, so I will start unboxing them, well, after through this video actually <laughs> but anyways enough jibber jabber let's get into what's sold for this week all right uh report for october 16th through the 22nd my total sales were 1543 dollars and 33 cents so like i said uh wasn't a great week for me like a uh, saturday and sunday was not great for some reason um but monday <laughs> the sales start picking up so um like always uh ebay's uh roller coaster um my t net sales were 1078 dollars and 45 cents with a selling cost of 360 dollars and 65 cents only 49 items sold which is really bad for me uh average sale price was 31 dollars and 50 cents so um, not a great week, but I did sell a few awesome items, and let me show them to you. Let's start off with a plush. Plush. We have uh, some Doberman. Uh, these are two of the same guys. These are Doby Doberman. Uh, one has a tag, one doesn't. Um, when I do tie. I always lot them together. Um, the Beanie Boos you can sell uh, separately, but the ties, uh, the original ones, just lot them together. Lot them in twos, lot them in threes and uh, they usually sell for me um, this guy sold for sixteen dollars and ninety nine cents uh the next one oh computer jumped on me <laughs> the next one is a gun pusheen i believe i picked these up at um either target or walmart they were a nice clearance and been selling a, a bunch of them uh, this was finally my last one i think i picked them up for a buck or two i don't remember exactly um, but he sold for $33.14, so if you find different Pusheens, Pusheens can sell for some good money. And uh, make sure if you get them new, uh, keep them in the bag. Uh, people love their bags. They have some kind of like markings on them, so yeah, just keep them in the bag and they'll sell more. Next one is a Thai Halloween. These, I've had cases of these, so... I've had these probably six years, probably around when I started plush, maybe longer. <laughs> it's probably been longer than six years. Um, but yeah, I got cases of these. I had uh, the, the ghost uh, stars and moon and I had a dog with a, like a hat on and I had so many of these. Like I said, I got cases and cases, paid 50 cents, uh, probably actually less than 50 cents because they were... Um, uh, when they started counting, they're just like, here, take these, take these, take these. So, um, yeah, so I had cases of these um, almost out, actually. I only have two left. Um, I actually started selling them at around $14. Then um, they became popular again. The, the Ghost Stars and Moons became popular again. So I raised the price back up to 20 sold a couple of 20 and now I've dropped them back down to $16.99. So I believe I only have two left, uh, hopefully. <laughs> I believe the dogs are sold out, and I had like another one with a pumpkin. Uh, it's been a while, so I don't remember all the different designs I had, but I had cases of these guys. Uh, next one is the Dr. Seuss. Uh, this is a Coles Care Dr. Seuss. Uh, usually, Coles Care is only going to go for like fifteen to eighteen dollars. Um, this guy, of course, Grinch around Christmas. I mean, it's not Christmas yet, but. Um, that, this one has a special heart on it. Uh, he sold for $23.79. Uh, didn't have him listed too long, maybe uh, like three, four months. Next one we have, uh, it's a little pink pig. Uh, for some reason, I've been selling a lot of Easter stuff. The bunny rabbits, the pigs, the sheep, the lambs. I, 
People like Easter this year. <laughs> I don't know what's going on. Uh, this one I picked up, I believe, at Rite Aid for right after Easter. So it was like 90% off. Uh, that's when I'll pick them up because uh, they're way overpriced at like Rite Aid, Walgreens, um, all those places. But once they hit around 85, 90% off, I'll go in and swoop in and pick up everything they have. Um, this one I probably paid 50 cents, maybe even less, who knows. Um, he sold for $17.84. A uh, lot of Hello Kitties. These were tiny ones. Uh, usually I like to sell Hello Kitties one at a time, but uh, the tinier, smaller ones, I do lock them up. Um, these are just ones that I had lying around. Like, oh, I don't know what to do with these things. <laughs> They're not going to get me a lot of money, but uh, when you lot them up, they will sell. A uh, lot of three of these guys sold for $21.24. Uh, Barbie's still hot right now. Um, I thought it was going to be dying down but no I just sold this guy for $15.29 and it's just it's a tiny one it's a really small Barbie one let me see if I can show you the tag uh, there's the tag yeah it just says Barbie isn't <laughs> um, just for having the Barbie name people will buy it so uh, make sure if you have any Barbie uh, stuff get it up I mean that Barbie mo movie was huge so yeah people are still gonna buy it Another pink poodle sold, just like that. Well, I don't know if that's... Is that really a poodle? Uh, I don't know what that is. It's a dog, right? <laughs> this is a Burton & Burton uh, pink poodle. Uh, it had like, glitter, shiny um, stuff on her paws, and had two bows. It went to the same person that bought the Barbie. I guess they liked this type of, or style of dog with a ribbon in her hair. Um, this one sold for $17.84. All right, we're all we're out of the cute plush. <laughs> we're into the uh, different collectibles. The first one is a Superman bust, the paperweights. These I wouldn't pick up unless you get them super cheap. They take a long time to sell. I think this one took me like a year and a half. Um, the paperweights have, I mean, they're cool looking. You can see the, they really look nice. But yeah, the paperweights um, they sell, but. They take a little bit longer to sell than normal, like, uh, Superman action figures and stuff like that. Uh, this one I just picked up from my toy guy. Um, this is a Jaws. Real, it, the remote actually works. You push the buttons on it. And the TV actually works. It has, like, buttons on the side. Uh, just needed some batteries. And, but it, like, shows clips from the uh, movie, which... <laughs> it's like a almost like a Funko Pop but you know because it has a Funko Pop box kind of um, but yeah it's a working TV let's put working TV Funko Pop right <laughs> uh, next one I had found a bunch of these M&M uh, calendar figurines uh, so I just finished listing them uh, they were in my garage so they were just hanging out so listed a bunch of these I actually sold uh, a couple of them today so uh, you'll be seeing a few more in my next video uh, but this is April singing in the rain and it sold for $37.39 next garage found uh, find <laughs> out of my garage uh, this is anthrax uh, he's actually missing you can see a little antler um, but yeah, he goes for good money. I actually put it, miss it, or antler, <laughs> antenna. Uh, but yeah, he comes with uh, three little, um, like a, what is that, an axe, a ball and chain, and a club, and two antenna. <laughs> and he goes for some good money, even without the box. I'm sure if he had a box, it'd probably be in the probably maybe the hundreds. So uh, make sure to look him up if you find um, some... Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. Uh, he sold for $59.49. The next one is a vintage bag from uh, Garfield. Uh, it's a canvas drawstring bag. I'm probably using it for uh, Halloween that's coming up, trick or treat. Uh, it's just Garfield in a Dracula costume. And I believe um, mom got this for me uh, in Walmart. Like, I don't know in the 80s <laughs> when I was growing up and I never used it I guess it was too small I wanted a lot more candy so 
uh, got this out of the garage so I have a lot of garage finds and listing it up so go through your garage um, free stuff is better stuff uh, this one I believe I picked this one up at uh, Amazon it was a huge speaker sale I don't remember what I paid but I'm sure it was really really low or I would not pick these big boys up um, they weigh about 15 pounds so yeah these are nice size speakers um, yeah this is the Sony XG 500 XC X series I sold it for three thirty nine ninety nine, and I still have one left I sold three already uh, one more this is Deadpool Deadpool movie coming out uh, Deadpool stuff is gonna be hot so if you find any loose figures um, any figures at all make sure you list them even this the side characters will sell um, this one sold for forty-five dollars and four cents and they're they're small they're not the bigger Deadpool figures but there's five different versions of them and <laughs> just different colors of them and last but not least this is uh, Hello Kitty um, they're like mystery bags anytime you find these mystery bags pick them up um, I keep picking them up from like, GameStop for like 50 cents each and then I lot them together and they sell for good money um, sometimes you gotta hold on to get a bunch of them uh, but this one sold three of them for nineteen dollars and fifty four cents so anyways um hopefully everybody's doing well um if you want to watch me un unbox some <laughs> cards those are the next videos coming up i'll probably do a plush unboxing uh next couple days too so um be a lot on my channel anyways uh don't fiddle fart around get all your listings up take care everybody don't forget to subscribe bye